let's start with uh, different types of uh, chemicals so one is petrochemicals petrochemicals means petroleum and chemicals so it's a mixture of uh, some petroleum products mixed with some chemicals it's a collective name for some organic chemicals derived from crude oils natural gas coal so these organic chemicals are produced from uh, living or once living organisms so you know crude oil petrol they are from the carcasses and this millions and millions of years these plants and animals die and their remains become these oils and coals so petroleum and natural gas marine animals and plants and all coal plants they are derived from that and some chemicals are mixed with that then there are some alcohols and car carbohydrates so we know all carbohydrates we all eat in the food and alcohols we all know so alcohols are derived from some hydrocarbons and produced by fermentation so these products only they are fermented like carbohydrates you have beer from your barley so alcohols like methanol ethanol all are products of this crude oil oils then vegetable and animal oil and fats so they are also all this vegetable oils like your castor oil the oils which we use at home for cooking and all so they are from sunflower or some seeds and animal oils fish oil and all so fats of animals and fish like palm oil is from palm tree then we have some acids and organic chemicals inorganic chemicals so acids and all uh, these chem inorganic chemicals which are not found organically or in natural form so they are made with in laboratories so they are tailor manufactured that is with a specific concentration of some chemicals they are mixed and the reaction takes place and the new compounds acids and chemicals are formed they are uh, made as per the requirement like in medicine or cosmetic or different industries and the basic manufacturing methodologies are somewhat same so the chemical requirements have increased or uh, many chemicals and if you see there are almost four or five thousands of different chemicals but generally which are transported by sea are around thousand and still keep they keep on discovering and keep the required as per the requirements the things keeps changing and we can see there is a chemical data sheets or book for the chemicals which are exported which is called cris code and manufacturing process we are not actually interested in we just want to know what chemicals are there on the ship and what are the, the precautions and properties so that we can get from msds material safety data sheet and uh, all chemical compounds which uh, bel belong to a chemical family group and these are the different chemical families or classifications of different chemicals so they are acids acids are organic found naturally and inorganic found mixed uh, manually then some alcohols methanol ethanol aldehydes alkalis like sodium hydroxide or bleach and all then amines esters ethers glycols glycol as ethers halogenated compounds halogens hydrocarbons ketones nitriles and phenols so all this we have studied in chemistry in 6 7th and 8th then how they react and how they form that we will see so let's see one of the chemicals like we are we have glycerol glycerol is fatty acids Fatty acid is a carboxylic acid with a long unbranched alphatic hydrocarbon chain. Example, stearic acid. The tail of a fatty acid is a long hydrocarbon chain, making it hydrophobic. The head of the molecule is a carboxyl group, which is hydrophilic. Fatty acids are main components of soap where the tails are soluble in oil dirt and their heads are soluble in water to emulsify and wash away the oily dirt. Fatty acids can be saturated or unsaturated. For example, butyric acid is a saturated fatty acid. Oleic and linoleic acids are unsaturated fatty acids. 
Fat is a major source of calories or energy. Fat improves the taste and odor of foods and gives a feeling of fullness. Fats form the structures in our bodies, including muscles, nerves, membranes, and blood vessels, and are essential for the absorption of fat-soluble vitamins A, D, E, and K in the body. Edible animal fats are butter, lard, cream, meat, and so on. Vegetable fats are olive oil, peanut oil, flaxseed oil, corn oil, and so on. One tablespoon of butter equals 100 calories, which is either saturated or unsaturated. Triglycerides Triglycerides are the chemical form in which most fat exists in food, as well as in the body. They are also present in blood plasma. It is the major source of energy and common type of fat present in our body. Glycerol Saponification is the hydrolysis of an ester under basic conditions to form an alcohol and the salt of a carboxylic acid. It is the reaction of a metallic alkali with a fat or oil to form soap. Triglycerides are hydrolyzed in presence of sodium hydroxide to form glycerol and soap. If NaOH is used, hard soap is formed. When potassium hydroxide, KOH is used, a soft soap is formed. That is about the different chemicals carried on board.